take these off and be polite. Good morning, guys. Happy Sunday. Welcome to another week in my life. This one is going to be Sunday to Friday for you guys. Uh, yeah, I'm super excited. I'm in a really good mood today. I don't know if you guys can tell if I sound congested or not, but um, I woke up yesterday. I don't know. I think it's allergies, but I woke up and I freaked out. If you guys don't know, I work on a cancer unit and we're on, like, we're a locked unit and we're on outbreak. So I was really scared I got sick. So I had to call in sick to work, which really sucks, but I just took the day to relax. I feel a lot better today. I went to bed at, like, 8 p.m. last night, so I got, like, a good 10 hours of sleep. I woke up at, like, 5.30, though, and I could not go back to bed, so I just, like, got up and started my day. It is 7.10 right now. I work at 7.30. I'm super early, but like I said, I've been up since 5.30, so I was like, you know what? We're just going to come to work early. Whatever. Got myself a coffee um today is my second last day i'm so excited of work um like not ever but um my stretch my weekend starts tuesday which is really exciting for me hashtag that shift work life um but yeah i'm in a really good mood um and what not so that's good i work at the clinic you, if you guys didn't know like my hours at the clinic just pretty much got completely like shut down um yeah, I don't know why. I just have dealt with it. I have like four to eight hours a week there, which is why you guys have probably noticed I'm not working a lot, but it's fine because if you guys didn't know, I'm now a permanent part-time employee at the hospital, which is super exciting. Um, so I think I work, I work tomorrow another 7.30 to 3.30. Um, guys, there's just like something about early mornings that I just, I love. I love it so much. It's, what was I going to say? I don't remember. <sighs> it's so nice out. It's time for break number two. I only have an hour left in my shift. And we're going to get coffee. Guys, I don't want to go back to work for the last 30 minutes. I only had two coffees today. That is an accomplishment. After this, I was going to go for a run. I don't have my gym clothes in my car, so I might just go home and hang out until dinner, and then I'm going out to get drinks, because why not? We are literally going on week four of a heat wave. Not that I'm complaining, I love it, because like this is like my inner Texas weather, but you know, sometimes it's just, you can't ride in this weather unless it's like 6 a.m. or like 9 p.m., so. Okay, it's 3.40 gonna head to the drugstore I need to go pick up my birth control because we don't want no babies in here um and then while I'm there I'm gonna get some allergy meds keep my warrior scar I fell in a bush on my birthday yeah it hasn't gone away and yeah and then I'm gonna go home for dinner and then I'm gonna go to M's house because we're gonna go get some drinks with some friends I'm so excited and yeah Good morning everybody. Happy Monday morning. I work at 7.30 but I've been trying to get up a little bit earlier just so I can like sit down and have a real breakfast before I start my long days. Like I said I've just been trying to get up like a little bit earlier so I can enjoy like a good breakfast and a good coffee. I really really quickly wanted to just talk about this coffee that I got sent called Maximum Slim and I'm obsessed with it. It is so delicious guys. Oh my freaking god. These which are like 12 actual packs of coffee. And then they sent me this tin as well. Um, but this is espresso. Um, I am obsessed with this stuff, guys. It tastes so good. And I find it wakes me up just a little bit more than regular coffee does. So basically, it's instant coffee. So all you have to do is bring your water to a boil, add the coffee, mix her up, add your milk and your cream and your stuff, and you're good to go. It's actually been proven effective to help your energy and your mental agility for the day, which is really cool. Um, and I don't know, it's just like, coffee's something we all drink, so why not drink a coffee that's gonna do, you know, some extra benefits and whatnot? Blend of green coffee and some natural herb extracts, which is kind of really cool. It's actually supposed to help with weight loss too, which I had no idea with, which is actually really, really cool. 
um, and it strengthens your immune system, which is pretty freaking cool. So I'm going to go make a cup of this, and thank you so much, Maximum Slim, for sponsoring today's video. If you guys want, I'll leave their links down below for you guys to go check out. It's a very fitting mug for Monday morning. Guys, this is ridiculous. Look how many freaking coffee creamers we keep in our house. Hey guys, I usually get the chance to like cherish a sip of coffee before I have to come get ready for work. What did they say? Just dusted off a bagel. I'm charging my Apple Watch. And yeah, it's 7.10. I work at 7.30. I'm going to go inside in the next few minutes, but I figured I'd run you guys through my day really quick. Don't really have anything. Today's my last day of work before two days off. Technically, I'd say three days off because I work a night on Thursday, so I count that as like I have a day off. I'm in a really good mood. Last night, we didn't really do too much. Um, Emma and I and two of our like really good friends, we just went to Lone Star to have dinner and I didn't vlog because that would be weird. <laughs> I'm not used to that yet. Um... And then we just came home and I went to bed like right away because I wanted to get really good sleep. Still feeling really congested, but I just popped some allergy pills, so hopefully that helps. Um, what's going to go right tonight? I still might, we'll see, but my dad, if you guys didn't know, my dad's a firefighter. And every Monday they have like, you know, they all meet and stuff. And anyways, this week if they're doing like a role play, like casualty thing on a big double decker bus. And my brother was supposed to go and be a casualty, and he's going to the cottage, and my brother wouldn't be able to go to the cottage, so I, the great sister I am, volunteered myself, so I get to spend my whole night playing fake dead on a bus for a firefighter to save me. So, hopefully it's a hot firefighter, but we'll see. It is 1.30, and I'm only taking my first break now. forgot to vlog on my way home hi guys I finished work on my way home now it's four I have half an hour before I have to be at the fire station so I'm just gonna probably eat something quick and then fix my hair like put some dry shampoo in it change and head over it's literally like down the street from my house so whatever and as soon it's 5 20 and I don't want to leave yet so I'm not going to but I literally did nothing except to fix my eyebrows because I don't care but my hair is literally crazy and yeah that's what's going on Good morning, everybody. Happy Tuesday. What is this? It's my day off. I feel actually really shitty today. This is a beautiful day outside, guys. Beautiful beautiful day out super nice out it's only 20 degrees probably still hot to ride honestly but whatever going to get a coffee I'm driving into town to get a coffee you know see come winter I don't have to do that because I like hot coffee but in the summer I can't drink hot coffee I could buy cold brew but it's like my nice way to get out in the morning so going to get a coffee gonna come home I don't know if I'll ride if it's this hot out but I keep checking the mail like frantically because I'm trying to donate stem cells, which is something really exciting. Obviously, since I work on a leukemia floor, I've become like more knowledgeable on like auto and allo transplants and stuff. And the auto hospital is one of the four in Canada that does stem cell stem cell transplants. And so I signed up. I did like the pre-screen and stuff. And now they're gonna send me a kit to swab my mouth and see if I'm a match for anything. And then they will take my stem cells. So I've been like keeping an eye out for that because I am so excited. But. Welcome to Hi there, can I get a large iced coffee with lactose free milk? One second here. Anything else? Um, and can I get that less sweet, please? 
Yeah, just one second here. The coffee. I'm so excited. I am gonna get this up. This is actually a really short vlog. vlog. It's probably gonna only be about four minutes. So look at that. I took me like 10 minutes to edit that. So I'm editing that a lot. And then I think I'm gonna start editing my week in my life. Wow, okay, I put some makeup on. I look like an actual human being now. Just got off my intake call. It was pretty good. It was just like an intake call. You know, they literally just ask you some screening questions and stuff. I'm back in the car now. I just cleaned my car and everything. She's all nice and clean. I am going to drive by the post office and drop this off. It has water on it. I'm going to pick up a Gatorade or something from the store. And then I'm going to head out and feed Mr. Oli Beans. It's 38 degrees, so way too hot to ride. Came over to say hello. Do you want to eat? You want to eat? You hungry? Hi. Good morning, good afternoon, my bean. Apparently, we are just gonna sit here and eat all day. And the pony in, we've got a nice walk today. He's got some pep to his step. No, we're not eating. We're going to work, Oli. So currently, walking Mr. Back. This is how lazy people walk their horses when they don't feel like actually walking. It's just a bird, you're fine. Thank you. The best six-year-old ever. I swear. So I'm just gonna leave that to soak. I'm going to get a water bottle. I'm oh yeah, so delicious. I have no more treats for you. Bye Bean, see you tomorrow if it doesn't rain. I am back, I just finished, like I just put on some more eyebrows cause I was not looking cute. Um, So, so my God, I can't talk. My hair is so freaking curly today. I am slowly getting ready to leave for softball. It's 4.30. I'm just going to work at 6, so I'm picking her up downtown. I was going to go to Lululemon today, but tomorrow when I get my tattoo, there's a little lemon right beside it. So my mom was like, just go then. So I'm going to do that, but I'll still go pick Emma up downtown because I have nothing better to do. Like, I'm not going to make her bus. So, yeah, going to go play softball. I'm not sure how much I'm going to vlog tonight just because, like, I'm going to be with my friends and stuff, but... Hey guys, what is up? So it is currently 10.30. I'm about to head out on a run, but I am just, I got a package and I like literally am super confused because I did not order anything. So I'm gonna open it. I figured I'd open it with you guys. Oh my God, it's my, ah, uh, it's my, um, my medal. My 5k medal because it was incredible themed aside. Oh my god, it's so cute. Ah, look at it. Braided my hair, so excuse me, looking like a bald eagle, but heading out to the lake to run now. It's about like 10 minutes from my house, and I like to run there. Not actually, I don't know why I'm running there. I really don't really feel like it, but whatever. Keep the weather, like perfect running weather. Also, it's starting to look a little dark. Maybe I should not have gone for a run looking pretty cloudy I'm not too sure how I feel but anyways this is the lake I just parked like right there but this is the lake it's so pretty it's like literally in the middle of our town 
and there's a complete running path. Literally, it's so pretty. All right, guys, so just finished my run. Today was just a 30 minute, like, I didn't have a set distance I had to get. But oh my god, that was a good one. I usually do 60 60 intervals, and today I did 60 30, so I'm a little tired, but that's okay. Hi, I'm gonna get for you. Hi there, can I just get a medium iced coffee with extra ice and less sweet, please? Yeah. Um, and that'll be it, please and thank you. Alright, Thanks. No problem. Decided to switch it up and get some cream today because, you know, I literally, not that it's bad that I go under my fats because I count my macros, I always am under all my fats, which is probably not a bad thing, but I was like, you know what? I freaking deserve to get some cream in my coffee and not milk today. Ew. Wow, surprise, I'm eating a breakfast sandwich. I have to leave in like an hour. So I need to eat this, put makeup on, straighten or curl my hair. And yeah, so I'm gonna do that, watch YouTube. It's like tradition for me on my days off. Alrighty guys, so I just went ahead and put some makeup on. My face is pretty red, I don't know why. But I'm just wearing mascara, that's it. Got some shades on. I got some new aviators today, thank God I needed some. I got some black ones. Update, I changed into a tank top. Like, I'm actually sweating. I just walked outside and I'm like actually sweating. I'm so cute. I made my mom a peanut butter sandwich because she won't have time to come home and eat. My... Every time I hear Brett Eldridge now, I cry because I I just love him so much and he was the best concert ever. Um, but yeah, my mom works in town, so like there was no point in her coming back home just to go back into the west end of Ottawa to get my tattoo, so... I don't know where I got this from. It came yesterday. Anyways, last night was super fun. I guess I didn't really talk about it with you guys, but um, we had we had softball at 6.30, and then afterwards, Em was house-sitting again. I feel like Em and I are always house-sitting. Um, and the place we're house-sitting has, like, a nice big pool, so we had some friends over, and, like, almost our whole friend group came, actually. And we had a pool party for a few hours, and it was literally great. I'm so sad summer's like, coming to an end, but we also have a lot of memories to make in the next four weeks, and I'm really excited. <laughs> What is up? I'm back in my car now. You guys probably saw some clips of my mom and I just hanging out downtown. My tattoo was so quick. It took 10 minutes. Do you guys want to see it? There she is. Anyways, it's kind of a weird spot, but I love it. Took 10 minutes, super quick. We were out of there by 310. Um, wasn't really painful. It was just like a bit uncomfortable. But yeah, it didn't really hurt at all. Then we walked around, we got some, we went to this cute little place called Little Joe Berry's in Ottawa. It's like a little vegan cafe and we got some treats there. We walked to Lulu because I've been wanting this bag from Lulu forever and I finally, finally, finally bought it today with my birthday money. I'll show you guys when I get home because it's in my mom's car. I'll do a little halt too because I went to Winners while I was waiting for my mom and I bought some stuff. I'm debating going back in because there's a really cute tank top I saw there. I am going to go into work really quick and show everybody my tag. What is up? Ooh, I just finished work. It's two. I told you guys I was working double because I thought for some reason I was. And then I checked my schedule and I didn't have a shift to the hospital tonight. But I was like, I definitely do. So I called and I checked with staffing. I checked with them twice and they said I didn't. So I'm paranoid that I'm going to like mess up and have to work. But anyways. Long story short, guys, last night when I came home from Emily's house, I came in the house and then my ears started fluttering and then I started freaking out because I thought a bug got in there and then it stopped and then this morning it was like all plugged up and like I made one of the nurses look and she was like, I see something in it but it's not a bug, it's just like a stick so it might be like a bug leg so I freaked out and I made a doctor's appointment for 240 because my ears all like blocked up now so I'm gonna go get that done, dealt with and then at the same time my belly button it's not infected but it's just been red for like a month and a half since I got it pierced so I'm gonna see if they can 
um, like give me something for it because clearly what I'm doing is not working. And I leave for vacation in a week, so I was like, you know what, I should probably just get this figured out. So, gonna go deal with that, and then I guess since I don't work, I'm gonna go ride or something. is to go home well I have to go drop off this prescription at the pharmacy but drop that off go home eat dinner go ride maybe hang out with M after I don't know I'm mean, nice to each other like every day but there's some pretty dark ass storm clouds coming and I didn't think it was supposed to rain tonight I checked the weather purposely so I could ride but it's fine because tomorrow I don't work till 3 30 so not a big deal that is not looking very promising for riding tonight to be honest you know you've achieved you know you've achieved full adult status when you get very excited that your favorite toothpaste is on sale for four dollars off so i didn't buy one or two i bought three of them we're going to the barn I'm gonna... hi his nose he's fat no 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 look at all the buggy holy Want your food? In your belly. She says, why is everybody watching me eat? Oh, it is really sleepy today. Sorry, bud. Yeah. Alright, guys. So, I'm at the barn with my mom. I don't know if she got any clips of me riding, but I just finished a really, really good ride. We're tired now. We even cantered a little today and we picked up our leads, which is good. But we're walking back to the paddock and we're going to go see Salem now. Say, come. Say, is that apple yummy? Oh. Salem. Say. Hi. Hi, hon. Hi, hon. Hi. You can barely see me, but I just got home a little bit ago. My mom made me pancakes, as you guys saw. I'm heading to the pharmacy because I never went and got my prescription, and I want to start my antibiotics tonight so we can GTFO this belly button infection, whatever. I don't know. So, I need any gas, and gas will be cheap now instead of tomorrow morning because I don't have enough gas to get me to the work tomorrow. <clears throat> go now you know what I mean like we're just gonna drive into town and go good morning everybody happy Friday sorry if you guys can hear the fan in the background <clears throat> today I'm not sure what's going on it's 10 I work at 3 30 so I'm gonna start to get up and get my day rolling um last night when I was in bed I just edited my week in my life up to like right now so it's pretty much done not sure if I'm doing anything tonight. I know tomorrow night I'm going out with my friends, but not sure if I'm doing anything tonight. Um, not gonna ride. I'm gonna give Bully the day off because he had a pretty hard workout yesterday. Um, yeah, so I went to the bar. My mom came with me. I forgot to ask her to videotape it. I don't know why I forgot, but 
I rode Mr. Oli, he was great, and then we went to visit Salem, and yeah, so it was a great night, and then she made me pancakes for dinner, so I might have some of those for breakfast, but I'm going to have to go get some groceries for lunches this weekend, so I'm going to go do that now. Guys, we're just stopping to get a coffee before I go in to get groceries, because, hi, that's important. Um, yeah, so we're going to not get a ton of groceries, like, I don't want you guys to think my parents don't feed me or anything. They do. I just get my own extra groceries sometimes. You know, you feel? Oh, guys, I really want a breakfast sandwich from here, but I'm just going to make my own instead. I was really excited. I was really excited to be home and just chill, but now my dad... Oh my god, I'm breaking out. What? Stop. I have to go pick up a check for my dad downtown. I don't know why he has to text me that at noon. Why couldn't he text me that at like 9 a.m.? So, gonna go downtown and get that check for him. Um, I guess I could just go get it later, TBH. Here? Okay, you guys can kind of see me from far away, so I'll just leave it here. Okay. We got some Scooby Doo pasta because it's my favorite. A dollar for this bad boy. Um, to go with that, I got some good old light tomato basil ragu. It's my fave, and I have some turkey meatballs. Got two gala apple favorite coffee, which is the So Fresh Cold Brew Cafe Latte with cashew milk. It's so good. It's so good. And it has like cinnamon in it. This big thing can probably make me about like three coffees, and this is three dollars. Then I got two of my, okay, I've been trying to not drink Monsters, but they were on sale for $1.99 in Canada. They're usually like $4.50, so I just got two just, just whenever I need a boost. Waiting for my mom to give me shit. Oh my God, guys, I'm obsessed with cucumbers. Like, I freaking love cucumbers. Like, I could literally cut up a whole cucumber and eat it. Like, anyways, cucumbers are usually two bucks. They were 50 cents, so I got two. I really should get more. Got some natural, extra lean, smoked black forest ham. Meat is really expensive at this grocery store. I don't know why I got it, but yeah, it doesn't have a lot. Usually I get like the double pack for like six bucks, but whatever. Um, we got some strawberries. And then I never buy these, but like they were $3.99 and they kind of looked good. They're baby potatoes, white cheddar, and rosemary. I figured this would probably, let's see how many are in here. This would probably make like three lunches for me. Like if I do like potatoes and chicken. So this is what they look like. I'm just lazy and like, yes, I buy things that are made for my convenience. And that's my grocery haul. Wow, shocker. Look what I'm having for breakfast. It's wanted bounce of the week is my Imagine Dragons. All right, guys, we are on our way to work. I'm done work. I'm so excited. I am going over to Brooke's house. Guys, it's starting to get dark so much earlier now. 